Hello everyone, Gokoin here and welcome to another episode of Foundation in the Antigua map. Actually, I've done like a little bit of uh, some work off camera. As you can see, I kind of like, you know, fenced this area with a stone wall. I also, the main things I did also, I fenced this area. We're building a cattle farm here and we're building a corn farm here. I think it's going to look great. We're actually also building a lord manor over here and i think that one is going to look fantastic this is a stone uh, stone based made out of stone lower manor i also unlocked there's a lot of things that i unlocked here on the on the kingdom side i unlocked the hunter's hut which we i don't think we're going to be doing or unlocking uh, in this series or using actually i don't think we're going to be using it maybe we are maybe we do in the future but since we don't have heavy forestry area i don't I'm, I'm not i don't think we're gonna be using it much i also unlocked the weapons meat and i placed it next to the our military uh like uh, space here our military area i placed it right here along with a storage I have a small storage unit so so they can store everything there we also i stop i also stopped the trading post we are not exporting anything we're at capacity for importing planks and tools so we're currently sitting at 196 tools and remember we're making our own tools as well and as you can see here the stone went down quite a lot because we exported quite a lot of things and uh, quite a lot of stone as well as this is taking 261 stones there's a monk asking for an audience let's see what they want they want 10 tools i mean we shall assist why not right we we have plenty we can give some to hmm, the labor sounds uh, like that we're gonna be using adding these two but let's do let's do the clergy because the monastery is around, actually around the corner I, I actually sent our military on a mission so it's an easy mission i sent them pretty much all of them uh, i sent uh, one two like four eight and we only have like five available i'm not gonna do the military mission this one right here we're building a church you know about that this church right here it's coming up along nicely uh it's uh it's gonna be a massive church right another thing i did was i moved the farm or the farming area like the poultry farm over here i tried to enclose the sheep somehow but i wasn't able to the sheep will walk outside the fence i think there's a fence the, that we can use that it it'll work as a wall basically but i don't know which one it is i tried several ones and i i didn't get it to work so we are we are of course producing we're going to be producing the cattle and behind the cattle it's not it's we have two options for the cattle we have the cattle yard or the daily farm so what i did basically is i produced cattle i i did the cattle yard uh, added some hay middle like you can see here and then with this one we i mean it's daily farm but it's the same thing we can actually uh with the with the cattle farm we can put you know process or slaughter our cattle for carcasses which are going to provide you know hides and tallow and or the milk and this is what 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 i the, the, the route i went i went here i i told them to start producing milk and now of course i added the dung heap now once we that's bill and we have enough milk enough milk i'll produce some milk uh, or cheese actually that way we can start selling cheese as you can see here um the lord manage it's gonna be big it's gonna be beautiful and then i place a tax office here on the back the market here we're selling clothes which we are not producing at the rate i would like to 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 it for it to produce so we'll need to look into it in this episode the corn sells for eight gold coins i realized that and that's fantastic of course the corn is helping us it's you know it's not only helping us for selling it uh, like raw corn but also to produce bread that's why i added another corn farm here i think that's amazing oh ooh, ooh, look at all the freakery yeah the flickery unfortunately we're gonna need to play with it until you know until the end because i have not been able to fix it now one thing about the the sheep farm is that it doesn't produce that much sheep or um, as much as i would like to i don't know why though because as you can see we only that's why we don't have enough cloth right because we don't have enough uh, wool i mean we have a lot of cloth right we just need probably another weaver hut but but at the same time if i add another weaver hut that's gonna cause the the cloth to go down 
as I, as you can see food is becoming not a, a a something to worry about but something that's going down quite fast as you can see uh, the veggie uh, are down by a lot almost half of it or actually more than half you know we're not producing as much fish as uh, as uh, we we are i mean as we should although it's we have five fishing huts here i don't know how how many more do we need so i don't see any fishing banks around these areas you can see maybe there's one here back but there's nothing in here so oh you know we have to rely on this production of fish i mean we can add like three more if we have to if we absolutely need to but that, as of right now i don't think i don't think we need i mean we have plenty of entertainment and i think it, that's uh we need to promote everyone to to commoners i think it's time to promote a lot of them to commoners most of the areas are very are high uh you know like as you can see this is a high desirability this one's gonna be high once the the lower manor is built this one is high over here and this one hopefully will be high once the up oh, once this is completely built yeah it looks like uh it's requiring uh three three more sculptures at least so once that's built i'm i think this is gonna be a high so let's go ahead and do all right so we just need to take a look at this so all those houses right there we okay so this guy it's right here so we promote this guy over here i'm gonna try to i'm gonna try to promote people from high desirability and not from low desirability for example this guy over here i think it's low desirability well kind of high we can actually improve that one so let's go ahead and do a couple more here let's see how many we have we have a um, total of uh, 49 50 let's go up to 60 i'm gonna i'm gonna grade all of them let's see if 56 1 2 3 and 4 and let's go 70 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 and 10 all right let's see how crazy this costs this this is gonna be <laughs> i'm pretty sure it's gonna be insanely crazy lots of people requiring a lot of stuff at the same time let's see so we all this episode we're gonna be to keep track of these guys the commoners especially so they're complaining about entertainment goods water service i mean you have plenty of everything around the area it's up to you so this market looks a little bit funky you know with the with the hill but you know it's okay i'm not gonna complain about it all right so let's add them a weaver hut and i think i, I think that's uh one thing that we'll, these commoners are going to require a lot the goods right so we have to do a tailor shop that's what we want to do and although it's very far I'm, i might add another another like sheep farm around this area we'll, we'll see we'll see how it goes but if we if we go too far though we need to start thinking of adding probably uh like you know things on the back like residential area we have to see yeah we're not promoting anymore and no access to goods now what we can do since we have plenty of stone plenty of ruins left right well we don't have that much ruins left as you can see which is nice it's looking much cleaner for sure so what we can do is trade something what can we trade i mean i don't want to risk it too much i think i'm gonna do one one more for stone in exchange of i don't know if uh goods right of cloth not cloth but clothes yep i'm gonna do one of that in exchange of cloth and then uh, this guy oh he was uh, importing planks right so we have to unassign him or something uh, let's see clothes it's gonna authorize that and let's open up the ex you know the stone exporter and uh, let's let's have them i mean did, did it get a sign it did not get a sign let's give another an unemployed whether oh he's finishing up okay uh, whatever all right so we are we're gonna start importing clothes that's fine i mean it's not gonna be a big deal until this is built right here once that's built well it's not gonna be a, ha a fast production that's what i'm trying to say it's not gonna be a fast production but it's gonna be something all right so wow these we can actually wow look at these guys wow this is insane the amount of things that we can actually store in this uh barn so let's go ahead and play some uh where is it i don't see the oh this is storage this is no a barn oh well gg hold on let me see everybody's like 
okay so it can store everything okay ha ah, that's amazing so here's what happens as you can see here we can only store uh materials like a warehouse and then storage we can actually do a a you know like it was a granary then materials then granary okay so we're gonna store here wow this is this is actually really good so we actually don't need this storage unit right here so what we can do is uh empty stock and let's go ahead and place the wood here Ooh, official garden masterpiece we have unlocked the uh, the garden masterpiece which is nice so difficult average success probability extreme let's send them all so let's go ahead and play some wood here and then let's go ahead and play some so here we want to store wheat we want to store milk we want to store corn we probably want to store cheese in the future what else do we want to store we want to store for now let's leave it as is because hop is something that we're going to probably be doing uh soon too so let's go ahead and tell them to yep let's go ahead and assign someone here someone let's let's put it at capacity just for now a house is upgrading yeah we're gonna have a lot of houses upgrading in this episode since we up you know we are up to what 70 commoners wow and now we could have done more but i just I'm, I, I like to take it i like to take it easy sometime from time to time it looks like there's gonna be a house be you know building here that's something we need to consider in terms of of uh service uh, maybe this is the place where we're gonna be placing the the massive big uh where is it called let's see where is it it's called the pagan worship one of these maybe this is the spot that they're gonna use it for yeah maybe yeah sure but uh, not for now at least not for now i mean we need we're gonna be exporting a lot of stone look at that we had 1500 stones now we have two and two eight hundred and eighty eight so a stone are becoming something that we need to worry about i mean we can add a uh, you know a stone uh, we can add those miners here if we absolutely have to i mean since we have everyone unemployed as of right now we can actually add them what about you looks like you are unemployed or you probably cannot find are you the importer uh yes you are sure are my friend so let's go ahead and assign you as a miner right there perfect and then is, it, is that how they call right miner yes that's yep perfect and then over here i'm thinking maybe we should add another let's see another one of these yep we should we definitely need to have add one of those right here can we add a third one i don't think we can though i don't i don't see any more yep i don't see any but at least two will, will do two will do because we're building the blacksmith here oh and it's uh would be oh wait a minute Who, oh no right here <laughs> i was like uh, we're building the blacksmith but i didn't place it there all right so here what we're gonna store is we're gonna store tools always storing tools everywhere iron and then we're gonna do swords right yep so for now just do all of those and we need people here so we can take it from the miner or we can wait for people to come in all right so lots lots of people complaining about lots of stuff looks so like their house is upgrading here all right so let's see what they're complaining about they're complaining about um housing and goods shortage okay so we should be starting let's go ahead and speed up time here we should be starting to import more uh clothes here and then what else do we have here that they're gonna yeah see the bread they're gonna start consuming two type of food so we might actually want to increase the our poultry farm that's why i i have these or we can i'm and actually it should be placing a I, I i think i placed a veggie farm here yep there it is so they're not building it yet so we probably need another builders workshop that's i think that's what we need there's a lot of things be, getting built all around the world Oh, around the city so why don't we place one of these kind of like here right i know we have one yeah we have one there we can actually place one of these like hmm i don't know it's interesting where do we want to place it eh, maybe here I, I think here is going to be a good spot i don't think they're going to be building any houses in this spot they're going to be upgrading it but uh yeah let's place it here like that perfect and then let's unassign people from the mining area one two and three and let's assign them to the builder perfect all 
All right, so we have some marble, gold, and everything. So what are we missing here? We're missing two more sculptures, and these guys should be working on it right away. So he's building, uh, he's creating sculptures right now. No projects at the moment, huh? So they're, he's probably like bringing it in. Let's see. I'm working. Yep, looks like, the, let's see. Who are you? You? All right, so maybe the, she's going to gather some materials. Who knows? All right, so here's the garden. And the garden, I'm pretty sure, I think it has to be built. Solar recovery speed by two. I think it has to be built with a lower manor, if I'm not mistaken. Let's see. If we open up this here, it says, optional effect when condition, number of decorative parts, including maximum. Okay, so it doesn't have to, I thought it has to be built with the, okay, that's that's good to know. It does not have to be built with the, with the, I keep for, forget about it, with the lower manor. So we, we can place it somewhere here. Oh, look at that. They're building their houses there. So yeah, they're going to be building lots of houses. So that masterpiece can be, be kind of like here, right? And then something like that, although it's going to be close to the farming area. I don't want it to be that close. We can actually place it here, right? But we'll see. Yep, there's the door. And that lower manor is like actually pretty cool. Oh, it looks like uh, didn't race this one. <laughs> Uh oh, or is that a bug? Or that... Did I place a... <laughs> I do not remember placing that there, but okay. All right, just give it... <laughs> just let it let it, let it, it be like that, right? All right, I'm, I'm very impressed about this. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> All right, so what else do we need here? So we, we're getting villagers. We're getting people. We we should be building more and more stuff. Like the... Like especially the food, right? It's going to speed up time here. Charge, huh? Nope, I'm not going to charge until we have some some good uh, uh, swords in our hands. So these guys over here, are they farming all of these? I think they are. I don't know why they're walking through here. They shoot him, though. But but that's okay. All right, so we're not... Act actually, we have to tell them to extract... Oh, we don't own this territory, huh? Well, we might actually want to own it. Well, not yet. I don't think it's uh, absolutely necessary as of right now. Because uh, if we if we own it, then they're gonna be coming here. But there's nothing that we can do here. Although, yeah, I don't I don't see any fish. Maybe here. No, I think it's like this area is gonna be for trade on here. Uh, tra uh, harbor trading. So let's make sure we we don't for I don't forget about that. Right, people complain about houses. Okay, that's something that uh, will improve once we build. Let's see, who's complaining? Who's the person who's complaining the most? Or you guys are out, builder, house, housing. Okay, so let's see your houses. Okay, you want to be, you're probably a commoner, are you? Yeah. So you want to be, uh, you know what it is? I don't think we have enough people. Let's go ahead and start assigning more builders. Because I don't think we have enough people to build their houses yet. So let's place this builder right. Kind of like. Uh, we can place him. I want to I want to be like in the middle of the city. We can actually place him. Uh, let's place him here just for now. We can delete it later on. But just for now, let's place him here. And then let's assign all of them right there. Yeah, because there's going to be a lot of houses being upgraded. Because we, you know, we increase or you know we promoted a lot of serfs to commoners this here this is a i'm hating this uh, i'm not liking this tangle here these tentacles all, all around all right so you are not producing any hay yet wonder why though let's see you should be producing hay uh, it says produces hay uh, in exchange of i don't know why it's not producing any hay do you need wheat to produce hay I mean, we can store hay here, right? We should be able to. Or it's like here. Hay? Yeah, there you go, hay. Let's do one more wood and then let's do hay. Just for now. So yeah, lots of people complaining about housing. But uh, once we build them all the houses, that should not be a problem. All right, so they need 30 gold bars. Wow. Yep, you're going you're gonna to suffer a little bit. Wooden keep builds. What is the wooden keep? Wooden keep? Oh, this one right here. Oh. Okay, uh, I forgot we were building this one. Let's assign it for a treasury, right? Well, no, see, 120 is not that much. Let's assign for a dorm so they can live in it. Is anybody living here? Only one person is living in it. Hmm. All right, that's up to them. If they don't want to live in it, 
They don't want to live in it. All right, so what do we have that we don't need at the moment? We probably need wait, uh, probably have enough planks, so we can assign a blacksmith here. We're going to need coal tools. Oh, okay, so let's go ahead and assign coal here, and we need a transporter there. So vegetable form finished. Uh, is that over there? Yep, it is. All right, so let's go ahead and do beans. We're doing broccoli there, so we're going to be doing beans. And we're going to do it this time all here, all the back of it. Perfect. I mean, this is not desire, uh, not, not fertile, so we want to avoid this area. So, yeah, we're going to do that square like that. Kind of like that. And, of course, we need, we need six people, I think. Yep, five people. So as soon as we get them, we'll work on it. All right. Lots of things happening in the city. The bailiff is available for mandates. Let's do the clergy. And, uh, you know, uh, happiness is increasing now. I mean, it's going up a little bit. It's not, like, going f fast. But it's uh, definitely working out pretty well as of right now. All right, so I think we don't need more tools right now. We can actually pause the production of tools for now. And then we can activate it later on. But uh, I'm worried about the food. I keep seeing the food going down, like crazy fast so i really want the food production to not stop if the food production stops or cannot keep up with the rest that's that's where things get you know starting to get ugly all right so this this residential area looks to be high but they're not wanting to place anything here so what we can do is let's go ahead and tell them not to and let's go ahead and reforest this area what is it right here reforest all this area right here that way we have more tool more more wood you don't want to be sleeping on wood for sure all right so we can build them a masterpiece here for for the desirability to go up right or because they have the church right here i mean this church covers a lot but oh 25 ah, the church hasn't even been built completely wow i thought this church was built completely so it looks like they need six more tools and uh what's that eight more polish stones polish stones might be oh okay it's a decent number it's not bad have we exported any imported any cloth yet huh it looks like uh, we might have exported some clothes but they're like gone <laughs> by now let's see so yeah all right so that that's something we need to consider here looks like uh our salvage yard we're gonna be deleting all of them once we don't have any more ruins to extract from this area. But it looks like our salvage yard is not uh, keeping up with the stone necessity. But it looks like someone is blocked and it's a forester. And where are you at? Path block. Oh, uh, okay, okay. That's fine. That's fine. I know why you I know what you mean. That's fine. I'm sorry, it was my bad. Forgot that we have ruins there. So yeah, those ruins. Once they're gone, we should be able to build them. I mean, they should be able to build houses there. I'm assuming, right? And I'm hoping so. No access to goods. Yep, I know. Are we producing any goods yet on here? It's, uh, yeah, we, we're building everywhere. I wish we had like an indicator of workload, right? <laughs> the builders are probably asking or doing way too much workload. No access to food. Okay, we're working on it. We're working on it. <laughs> All right, I told you guys it was not going to be an easy task to, uh, to promote so many people. Five villagers just came in. Okay, so let's go ahead and pause the game here and think about a strategy. All right, so that's not built yet. We can do another veggie farm here, or we can actually do another... Let's see. Yeah, we can actually do another bakery. I thought we had two bakeries, right? We have one here. And did, did I not place another one somewhere? I mean, looks like we I did not. What we can do is place them another bakery and um, and start producing because we have a, a lot of flour. So let's go ahead and do bakery. That's the thing about these guys. If you go fast, you're gonna have you're gonna be in trouble. I always say it. Don't go fast, and I keep going fast. <laughs> I always say don't go fast, and I keep going fast. All right, so let's go ahead and place them that there, and actually. It's going to place it there. And I don't see a whale here. We place them a whale here. That's going to help a little bit with the desirability. Kind of like here. Here might not be a bad idea. 
Yeah, I don't see a well here. I built a well here, but not any, not there. All right, an invoice requested an audience. Let's see what he wants. 30 dates? Yeah, I'll give it to you. I mean, it's not like we have plenty much any more dates. All right, so let's see. Hmm. We have 145 stone, 20 cloth. Are we bring any more cloth? I don't see... I, I haven't seen the Karen yet. Haha, <laughs> promotion available. I'll do surf only. Yeah, no, no, no doing more commerce. No, not even thinking about citizens yet. The citizens will require way much more stuff than we are doing right here. So let's go ahead and stop the export of stone. And, you know, we can just leave it for the cloth. But we definitely need to start thinking about producing more wool. More cloth. Now, this guy here looks like it's not producing sheep as much as we actually should be producing. I don't know why, though. I don't know how this is this works. If we do, let me see. If we do another sheep farm, for example, sheep farm, let's say, like, uh, somewhere here, maybe. If we do this, we have two options, the pasture and the yard. And I, that's, I think the yard might be best. I don't know. I don't really don't know if the yard might be best. But I'm going to give it a try. So let's go ahead and place one of these here. A couple of them here, right? All right, so I'm going to build this sheep farm. The one that requires uh, the shipyard with the hay and water. We can place a well in the middle. But I'm going to place this one because I don't. I, I want to see with a, along with a, with a wool production, right? With the shearing pen. That way to see if, uh, if it has actually, you know, produces more sheep than, than the yard. Or not than the than the farm itself. So I'm gonna authorize that. I know there's a lot of houses being built here, so that's definitely something that we need to consider if we want to. Add, well, they're gonna require service, right? You can see housing and goods shortage. Goods is the one that's uh, causing more issue. So if we want to absolutely help them, we can actually export polish stone, right? I don't think we need polish stone right now. Let's go ahead and export polish stone. I mean, we definitely do need polished stone, but but as of right now, I mean, we can spare some. So the only thing that we should be importing is, yep, cloth. That's the only thing that we should be importing, no, nothing else. All right, so let them to be. Let them be that. And then how is the, how is the blacksmith? All right, so no tools, huh? I guess, okay, so let's go ahead and assign someone there. They should be bringing tools here and call. Where is the coal being stored? Yeah, they should be bringing coal here. All right, so, I mean, I guess he just... Uh, he's getting everything. He probably just started working. <laughs> then complaining about everything. Wow. All right, so, yeah. We definitely need another bakery. We're adding it there. <laughs> we need a lot of things to get built. And uh, Oh, look at that. The church finished? Not yet, though. It's It's just right there. It's almost there, though. Almost there. It's going to assign some people here. The good thing about the military mission is that they help and they bring stuff into the city that uh, we're not producing. It's going to send them, uh, not the wounded. Let's send everyone but the wounded. Wow, this church is almost there. One more Polish stone. Please just bring it in. I mean, we are, we're not only going to get 100 gold coins. We have plenty of gold coins, but... But yeah, I, I told you guys in the last episodes, we're, get, we're, you know, we're getting behind on the food. And I knew it was going to happen. That's why off camera, I added more and more stuff here. But unfortunately, I didn't foresee the necessity of much more, uh, much more builders, right? Because right now, how many builders do we have in the city? Uh, let's see. We have 2, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18... 20 21 uh, i should be 22 i might have miscounted oh no well 21 oh exactly no it's it's uh, increments of three that's right increments of three and then we have seven builders workshop around maybe all right no access to food more houses being built here i mean these guys need to i mean do we want to uh, even add another builders workshop i think i might add them then for now and then we'll we'll delete it so in fact i'm gonna place this in the worst spot ever that way i know i have to delete it because the, the the reason i'm saying this is because 
there's a lot of things that needs to be built way a lot of things especially the houses the houses requires only wood but you know it takes time for them to deliver and they're they're, they're building their houses but they're you know sleeping on stuff like the church or they're sleeping stuff on, on like on the manor on the food mainly right because this corn and this uh, cattle farm should have been built long time ago all right so let's see here the church is almost there though it's almost done beautiful church almost done it really needs one more tool one more tool and that's it and the church has been built yeah guys the church has been built an attendance a weekly attendance of 50 was hoping it was more but it's a beautiful church and um i don't know if it increases the desirability around this area how big it yeah you see high most of these guys will be upgrading to commoner very high actually why don't we other up we don't own this territory why don't we own it let's go ahead and own this territory and allow more houses around this area i think that's gonna no, nope, not not that close. Let's go ahead and tell them to build houses not that close. Kind of like right here. And what we can do is build them a gonna extract all this area. We build them a a basically a a masterpiece here. That's what I'm trying to say. If we if they want to. But yeah, looks and um, we can actually put a, another market. Because how how far? Well, the market is not that far from their house. We can place another market there if we we absolutely need to. We're probably gonna need to. And we actually need a I did notice that. Let's go ahead and place a medieval. Where is it? Medieval. That one right there. Let's place them a a hand cart of goods. Let's place them a hand cart of goods. What about this one? Well, no, I like this one. Hand cart of goods. That way they can actually let's see how how is it? It's okay. Yeah, let's place them like Mm, maybe here yeah let's place in there let's see oh and they're gonna be selling goods there now another goods that we can sell we can sell we can produce candle we can produce common wares shoes furniture and pottery that's something we also can produce right and 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 that's something we have space for it right here and let me show you here the thing is that i haven't done more of that like towards that direction is because you know it requires more and more stuff for example if we decide to go let's say furniture right where is it it's a uh, furniture furniture well it's gonna be tough to find it the creamery this is gonna produce milk uh, butter out of milk butter uh, the butcher shop and then what is this the cider press the corn farm so if we go to i think we should be able to go to goods production there it is the cobbler it produces shoes out of leather but for leather we need uh we need of course <laughs> what do we need we need um carcasses and we need to produce leather so that's where so and this is the can chandlery sells uh you know make candles to sell at market now i don't know what's gonna require the candles produces you see and tallow so we need to start slaughtering some of our of our animals basically and that's something we could start doing but i don't know which one is going to be the ratio right is it better to sell candles or is it better to produce furnitures i think the furnitures might be better as you can see here the tannery this guy over here this guy is going to require one plank and one cloth to make one furniture the ratio is one one it's not the best ratio and this guy is a, jo is a joiner so we we have two type of of uh of furniture productions and this is of course the market we can sell that so we can actually add one of these guys here right i don't think it's gonna be a problem if we add them right there and we can actually add two of them if we want to but uh i think this guy over here might be a really nice place to put it and then we can actually sell furniture i mean we can even sell it here but no i'm not gonna sell it right there um so let's go ahead and build it let's see how it goes it's not uh it's not like um, it, we're gonna you know go crazy if we don't sell it but or we don't produce enough but we can do we can place a furniture guy here uh actually here right kind of like right there i like that area and then we can place another one over here if we have to now we're producing animals and if we want to do sheep or uh, not sheep or pigs right if we do pig farm 
I think that's gonna this is gonna be the best animals to slaughter. Uh, that's the only thing you do, right? Just slaughter the pigs. You get one carcass, one hide, and one tallow per pig, right? And that's something we need the tallow and we need the the carcass or the, the hide to produce hide for shoes, tallow for candles. Now it requires a feed silo. And the feed silo, it requires five wheat, five veggies, and five milk to produce 25 animal feed. And these guys, one pig for one water and one animal. So it, it requires much more stuff. It's not as easy as slaughtering uh, cows, for example, or slaughtering sheep. We can do... Oh, uh, hold on. Let me see. Let me remove these. I know there's a bad weather incoming. We can also do a goat farm, right? We can do a goat farm. It's going to require two goats in exchange for a carcass, a hide, and a tallow, right? It's not as 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 good as the sheep, as the pig, but of course, it doesn't require any kind of food. So we can slaughter the the animals, right? The goats. What, what, what are we building here? Oh, the, uh, the dunk. Okay. All right, so that's something we need to consider there. That's something that we can actually start looking into it. I saw a joiner's shop. Oh, this one here. Yeah, I'm not going to sign anyone yet there. We can also slaughter. Instead of producing this right here, we can actually remove these guys. That's also another thing that we can do. We can remove these guys right here, right? We can remove this guy and place a a what is it called a a slaughter we can slaughter. we can start we can start from here and then after that we can go from there right so we can do a slaughter area kind of like right here where we was yep and it, what it does is you need two sheep in exchange of carcass hide and tallow and i think that's what we're gonna do right now we can use this farm to slaughter and this one to produce cloth uh and, and we'll see that way we can we, that cloth is not the only goods that we need to sell. We can sell, as you can saw, as you can see there, or you saw there, uh, uh, candles, uh, shoes, uh, shoes. Of course, we need we need leather. How do we produce leather? Uh, it needs high, right? One high, one le leather. But I mean, we're at least one, two, three, three and four solution as of right now. And I think we have to take advantage of all those solutions while we can, basically. Uh, success probably I usually like to do extreme but I'm gonna authorize that for now our happiness is uh, actually very low and people are complaining about uh, food shortage and food shortage and that's something that's uh, a little bit scary a little bit worrisome but at the same time there's nothing to worry about you guys we'll, we'll be fine we'll be fine so we need hay farmers although I don't know why are not why are they not producing any hay yet is it because the, the 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 livestock or there's no livestock production yet i don't know i don't know we'll we'll see of course we're uh, putting up a bakery here the corn farm is almost built there's a lot of things happening at the same time but i don't think we're building anything else of course the the lord manor we can actually start assigning treasury for all of this yeah, the treasury is now up to 4340. That's nice. That's very nice. 4340. We're starting to get some uh tools. Uh, not, not tools, but source. I saw that. So we can actually start assigning some source to everyone. Let's go ahead and assign those. And once our people come in, we will give them more. So this bakery has been built completely. We just need to find out uh, where to get people from, right? Uh we can actually remove one of the builders workshop now because i don't see that the many stuff are getting built maybe the lower manor is missing and that guy over there so let's go ahead and tell these guys you did your job thank you for for working for us now let's go ahead and delete your stuff <laughs> and then we can assign a couple bakers here that's good there and then we actually need i think this got built completely but we actually need some hay right yeah there you go we need some hay I don't see any anything happening with this hay. Uh, it doesn't tell me what we need to produce that hay. I'm assuming, if we look at this, it does produces hay. Usually it says, produces one sheep in, and one dung in exchange of water and hay. But there's nothing 
that says hay around this area or it doesn't it doesn't say how produces how to produce hay another thing i did notice that we need a well right we can place a well right here kind of like right there i think that's that's gonna be good and then we can place another well oh well we have a well here for the baker so that's good the cattle farm is finished finally let's go ahead and assign a livestock so we're gonna be producing lots of stuff here lots of uh, milk and this is good also we we can we might be able to slaughter them here too i don't know how good the ratio is though but we we, we are have the able we you know we have the option of slaughter them so it's going to be one carcass one one high and one tallow in excess of one cattle so we can actually do that but since food is the main priority right now i'm just going to leave it as is and I, that now now that we have that we're going to start thinking about adding the the cheese maker but i'm gonna keep it here guys everything is looking phenomenal i think everything yeah, a little bit crazy right as you can see here the city is growing at a fast pace i told you once we upgrade or promote to a lot of call i mean from surf to commoners things were going to get nasty and that's how what's happened here things are getting a little bit nasty but we're gonna go you know we're gonna go through it it's not like you know it's uh we don't have money for example in nasty will be no money production i mean we have we have food we don't have a lot of food but you know we're we're producing we're starting to produce the food again and we're trying to keep up we're gonna start doing a lot a lot more stuff but thank you for watching thank you for being here don't forget to like subscribe and leave a comment down below i will see you in the next episode we'll see you next time i will see you very very soon bye bye